Hello everyone, today I am going to create these steps in Revit. But before we start, let me remind you to like and share my videos, leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any queries or difficulty, feel free to ask. Open new architectural template file in Revit. Click on stair in the architecture tab. This is not a staircase, so we do not have to attach it to level 2 so select none here the steps height is going to be 4 feet 6 inches the desired number of rises are going to be 9 so that makes it makes an ariser of 6 inches click apply then click on this little pencil icon here first of all we're going to draw riser so select a riser as these are circular steps, so select the circle here and add a radius of 20 feet. Give an offset of 2 feet till there are 9 threads. Now create a boundary as shown in the video. The boundary is depicted by green lines and the risers are depicted by black lines. The drawing of boundary and visor is now complete, so add the stair path as shown in the video. Finish this mod. Again click on this tick mark. The steps are now complete and it looks like this. We do not need this railing, so simply delete, select and delete them. Also, we to note this we do not need this part so delete it as well go to elevation and add a level at 4 feet 6 inches On level 3 click on floor and draw the boundary line of for the floors. You can add the material for the thread and risers in this dialog box. This floor is at level of 4 feet 6 inches but we also need a floor at 0 feet that is level 1. 
So go to level 1, click on floor and draw the floor as shown in the video. Now draw a wall on level 1 as shown in the video. You can control the height of wall by dragging this arrow button. Join this wall with the floor. Select this wall then click on edit profile. Go to elevation and change the profile as shown in the videos so that it is connected with the steps. Exit this mode, go to level 1 and sele select and copy this wall on the other side as well. The design of this courtyard is now complete. I Hope you like this tutorial. If you have any queries, feel free to ask. Like and share my videos. Leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel. I will meet you guys in the next tutorial. Till then, goodbye and take care.